Hi friends, in this video we are discussing one problem that is based on first order but not first degree. Right, x square p square solve x square p square plus x y p minus 6 y square is equal to 0. It is a differential equation of differential equation in terms of x y p f of x comma y comma p is equal to 0. So what is the p here means dy by dx. So dy by dx here you have na f of x comma y comma p is equal to 0 means first order degree is what here 2. So first order but not first degree. Methods to, to, uh, to solve this problem we have a different methods. First method what we are doing means solvable for p or not p is possible or not we have to verify. If it is solvable for p then we have to write like this p1 of f of x comma y into p minus f of x comma y into p minus f2 of f of x comma y is equal to 0 type we have to change. Right you see here this is a like a p square plus b p plus c is equal to 0. So first given problem I wrote here. Now to simplify this to get the roots what I am doing means this is minus 6 y square and this is x square. So 6 y square x square roots I can say this is I can write as 3 x y times of 2 x y. Yes or no? Next to this is if I take in plus 3 then this is minus 3 plus minus I will get x y. Okay, next uh, here you see this is p uh, and 6 y square here you have na? 3 2s, 3 2s are 6. Yes, I am getting this term same. So I can write this as 3 x y p minus 2 x y p minus 6 y square is equal to 0. From these two which is the common term? x is there. y, y? no. p yes. So x p is a common. 3 is not there you see. So remaining terms xp plus 3 x over y is there y left right. Now from these two, 2 is a common, minus is also common, x is there no, p is there no, y is there 2y. Then you have x p minus 3y is equal to 0, minus of minus plus no, is equal to 0. From this two, which is term is common, xp plus 3y times of xp minus 2y is equal to 0. Now you see this is product of two terms. Now this is you can also write as xp plus 3y is equal to 0. Where p is what? dy by dx. Na? So here what to do means just replace dy, uh, p by dy by dx. That is x into dy by dx plus 3y is equal to 0. Now this is first order first degree differential equation. Previously given problem is first order but not first degree. We are converted as first order first degree. So use a variable separable method if possible. Now if you take a dx and dy should be in numerator. So x dy plus 3y dx is equal to 0 into dx is 0. Now uh, variable separable is not, uh, not at What to do? dy coefficient should be y. dx coefficient should be x terms. So cross multiply. This is 1 by y dy plus 3 by x dx is equal to 0. Now integrating on both sides because it is variables are separable. Na? So log y plus 3 times of log log y plus 3 times of log x is equal to log c. So log, log a plus log b means log a b. Here you have a m log n type m log a means log a power m. So log y x cube is equal to log c. Taking anti log on both sides then you will have x y cube is equal to c. This is you can also write as y x cube minus c is equal to 0. So you have now one solution. Go for another solution. What is that you have? Another product is x p minus 2 y is equal to 0. p is equal to dy by dx right hand. dy by dx minus 2 y is equal to 0. Variable separable is possible. First dx dy should be in the numerator. So x dy minus 2y dx is equal to 0. Here also dy quotient is not a y term. dx quotient is not a x term. So just you cross multiply to simplify this one. x is take right side. Uh, then you will x divided with x divided with y type. So 1 by y dy minus 2 by x dx is equal to 0. Integrating on both sides now. 1 by y integration log y minus 2 times half. This is 1 by x integration log x. Uh, integral of 0 I can write as log because the left side log terms are there now. So this is you can also write log y and this is minus 2 log uh, this is log x square 
is equal to log c. Log a minus log b, you can get log a by b. Log of a by b. Y by x square is equal to log c. Now taking anti-log on both sides, then you will have y by x square is equal to c or simply y is equal to c x square or y minus c x square is equal to 0. Okay. Now you simplify these two. Multiply. Then y x cube minus c into y minus c x square is equal to 0. This is the solution of the given problem that is x square p square plus x y p minus 6 y square is equal to 0. Friends, next problem. Solve p cube plus 2 x p square minus y square p square minus 2 x y square p is equal to 0. Now you observe the given problem is in terms of f of x comma y comma p is equal to 0 where p is equal to dy by dx. So dy by dx means first order first degree but p is the, what is the degree here you have 3. So this is first order but not first degree. So you have to go for solvable for x y p. First of all I am checking for p is possible or not. Here you have p cube, p square, p square, p. So all the terms are containing p. Na? So take p is a common from this. Then you will have p common that is p square plus 2xp minus y square p minus 2xy square is equal to 0. From this, this is product of uh, functions I have read. From these two what I can take common? p common. From these two what I can take common? Minus y square common. Yes, p is a common, then you will have p plus 2x. Minus y square is a common, then you will have p plus 2x is equal to 0. From these two, which is common? p plus 2x is common. Then you will have p minus y square is equal to 0. p is left. Okay, this p also I wrote. Now, product of three terms, na? so you can also write this as p is equal to 0. P is equal to 0 means dy by dx is equal to 0. So dy is equal to what? 0. Integrating on both sides. Then you will have y is equal to c1 or c. So y is equal to c, one solution. Next one. P plus 2x is equal to 0. P is nothing but what? dy by dx plus 2x is equal to 0. Now cross multiplying. dy plus 2x dx is equal to 0. 0 into dx is 0 now. Now integrating on both sides. Then y plus 2 times of x square by 2. x square by 2 means x square is equal to c. Also you can write this as y plus x square minus c is equal to 0. This is y minus c is equal to 0. Uh, next another one you have na. So second one is also you got na. So p minus y square is equal to 0. p is nothing but what? dy by dx minus y square is equal to 0. dy minus y square dx is equal to 0 into dx means what? 0 only na. Now, but uh, variable separable? No. So, cross multiply. 1 by y square into dy minus dx is equal to 0. Now, integrating on both sides. Then, 1 by y square integration. You see, 1 by y square directly you don't have. So, I am changing in this form. y to the power of minus 2 dy minus integral of dx is equal to integral of 0. Okay. Now, y power minus y power n form. n is not is equal to minus 1. Now. So, what I can say means? Minus 2 plus 1 by minus 2 plus 1 minus x is equal to c. This is you can write y to the power of minus 1 by minus 1 minus x is equal to c. This is minus y inverse minus x is equal to c. Minus y inverse is nothing but minus 1 by y minus x is equal to c. So minus is common. You can also write a cross multiply. Just you cross multiply here. 1 okay minus 1 minus xy minus cy. This is equal to c1. Na? So take all our one set and take minus is also common. Then you will have this is xy plus 1 minus cy is equal to 0. xy plus 1 minus cy is equal to 0. Na? Okay, minus is I am taking common. Na? So cy is equal to 0. This is plus cy. You see, if you take a left side, minus cy here you have. Just minus. Now, these three you got it. Now from these three, what you can get the general solution? y minus c into y plus x square minus c into x y plus 1 minus c y is equal to 0. Be the solution of given differential equation p cube 
प्लस टू एक्स पी स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर पी स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स स्क्वायर सॉरी टू एक्स वाई स्क्वायर पी इज इक्वल टू जीरो ओके ना लाइक दिस वी हैव टू सॉल्व दी गिवन डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन व्हिच इज फर्स्ट ऑर्डर बट नॉट फर्स्ट डिग्री वी आर वेरीफाई फर्स्ट वी हैव टू वेरीफाई सॉल्वेबल फॉर पी और नॉट इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो वी विल सॉल्व सम मोर एग्जांपल्स बेस्ड ऑन दिस सॉल्वेबल फॉर पी थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो